figured it'd be all over the news by now. Officer's body dug up. He's held that one. Ethan, he's here. Dead? Yeah. And he was buried until he was dug up. Just like Claudia was. It's becoming a family tradition. Did the police know who did it? Well, no, I'm to clean up my mess. Isn't that what partners do? All right, you're right. This is a partnership. It goes both ways. So anything I can do for you? Uh, I just came by to uh, get the check to pay for the liquor license. Renew it? It's already renewed. You sent that check in last week, remember? Right. So why are you really here, Lulu? You want to see how you're doing. Don't say fine, because... Obviously, you're not, and that's understandable. They just, you know, your father. Grant, he was not. Fine, your grandfather. But that doesn't change the fact that he was the only family you had left, and now he's gone. So you have a right to feel to what, something. To grieve? Why would I do that? I'm better off. Believe me. So what was all this about? I had a moment. And now it's past. Hey, look on the bright side. At least I didn't have my moment with our new barware. Do the police have any leads? They know that Heather Weber buried the body. Do they think she killed him? No. The police commissioner likes somebody else for the murder. Anybody I know? Why are you having the question? No. And why haven't you answered me? Isn't your husband a cop? Why don't you talk to him? I'm pretty sure Dante is- Dante's not here, you're here, so stop stalling. Fine. There's an APB on a loop. He didn't do it. You seem pretty sure about I that. I am. Any particular reason why? Hmm. Now look who's avoiding the question. He swore to me that he didn't do it. And I believe him. When did this conversation take place? when they brought him and Tracy in for questioning. Oh, okay, I'm yeah, just curious when they did that. Did Tracy or Luke explain at all how Anthony's body ended up on the terrace of the Quartermain house? And was he dead or alive at that moment? Yes, So you've known this, this whole time. I'm sorry. My dad and Tracy found him in the boathouse and they took him up to the terrace and they, I don't know, he went missing and... Yeah, well, it's not missing anymore. The cops dug the old man up last night. I, look, this is so hard for me. I, I talk about how I want people to be honest with me and then I have to keep something from someone it affects the most. Yeah, well, it's just a question of loyalty, I guess. Yeah, my dad needed time to prove that he was innocent and all the evidence was pointing to him. That's the only reason why I didn't tell you sooner. Yeah, look, well, now he's had time to skip down. I know that this looks really bad. My dad did not do this. He did not kill Anthony. And I realize that in order to have a partnership, we need to have trust. So I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I should have told you that Anthony was dead. You deserve to know. I don't deserve anything. Why would you say that? You don't know what I've done. <laughs> my entire life, I tried to imagine what it would be like without Anthony.
himself for what happened to Anthony. He lived a very violent life. Which almost got you killed. That was a long time ago. So, I can't forget how close you came to dying that night. He would have pulled that trigger without a second thought, well, you know that. he didn't. But he could have. See, that's the thing with Anthony. He was so unpredictable. You wouldn't know where he was going from one moment to the next. One moment you could be fine with him. The next moment you're staring down the barrel of a gun. Well, that doesn't matter because Anthony's gone. And most importantly, you are in no way responsible. All right. Anthony said he overheard Tracy and Luke plotting to kill him. I didn't do anything to help. Okay, I know this looks bad on my dad, but I'm telling you, he didn't kill him. And you really think Luke's not capable he of murder? He would not risk Tracy getting charged as an accessory. Hmm. Well, your husband agrees. He thinks I'm a much better suspect. The theory is that I killed Anthony and dumped the body in the Quartermain boathouse in order to frame Luke and Tracy. Well, no matter how much you hated Anthony for lying to you for all those years, you didn't kill your grandfather that much, I do know. Well, I wish I had an ounce of your faith. Well, I have enough for the both of us. You wanna get your mind off of this? Go get chimichangas? Chimichangas. <laughs> Burritos? All right, thanks. But thank you for caring, for listening. It's nice having you around again. Anytime.